are two different ways to sync clips. One of them is by selecting the two clips and letting Final Cut do it. The other is by using markers. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to have Final Cut do it for us automatically and what we get as a result. I'm going to select the two clips here because these two go together. I'm going to go up to the clip menu, choose Synchronize Clips. And a second later, we happen to have a clip that's already been synchronized. When we go ahead and we look at our project, there's our synchronized clip. Notice the icon in the top corner. This icon refers to the fact that it's a compound clip. And if we open it up, it'll actually show up in our project library as if it were a project. I'm going to go ahead and double click on it. When we look at this, we can see that the waveforms match up throughout the clip. Now, this still needs a little modification, and we can see how to do that in another video. But at very least, when we hit play, it was big enough to run around and play. And, and... We have both audios in sync. Once we tell it not to use the camera audio and only use the external audio, which we're going to do in the modification section. The last thing I like to do with a sync clip is to select it and add a keyword to it. And the keyword is something like synced. That way I know it's finished and it's cleaned up and it's ready to go part of this keyword collection.